it has happened. Yes, yes, guys. Ooh. Another confirmation. Another confirmation, another confirmation, another confirmation. Thank you, God Almighty in heaven, the Father, the Maker of heaven and earth. The I am that I am. Nobody is above me. You are the God Almighty, guys. Yes, guys. In fact, before welcoming you guys, today is the biggest day. Today is the most happiest day for me. Why? Yes, the lazy gangs in Yapohanse, their end has come. Their end has come. Yes, guys. Guys, I've been saying this thing. I even did a video for them. And I've been making some, you know, telling them some of my 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 my, my texts and views or perspective on who they are in some of my videos. Yes, guys. But I did a dedicated video for them and I tagged them. Yes, guys. But let me welcome you guys. Welcome, 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 welcome. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. It doesn't matter where you are watching me from, guys. Welcome back. This is priceless. If this is your first time of being here, guys, kindly consider subscribing. Yes, guys, on this YouTube channel, we give you the very best of content, straight up, relatable, out of Abuja, Nigeria, Africa. Yes, guys. Guys, if, as I've said, if this is your first time here, we talk about documenting traveling experiences, study abroad opportunities, and text on global perspective just like this video yes guys today guys we are talking about the end of the lazy gang in Yabohanze village yes guys we are talking about the end of the lazy gangs in Yabohanze village in fact mm, yes guys i've been saying this thing i said lies have an expiring date lies have an expiring date and lies can never and will, it will never prevail over light, over truth. Truth is an orphan, but it is not really an orphan. Yes, why do I say truth is an orphan, but it is not really an orphan? Because when you stand for the truth, you will be lonely. You will see that you, the, 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 you, won't, you won't be attracting the right traction. But no one can tell you that what you've been saying or the truth you've stood up for is lie. But people that are peddling lies, people that are telling lies, one day a time shall come, a time gonna come, that yes, today they will tell you your lies has come to an end. Woo! Guys, fat guys, I'm feeling anyhow. God bless you, boss Marwa. See, in this life, guys, I've been telling us we don't fight some people. We don't fight some people. Let me use myself as an example. If someone wants to fight me, guys, they have been having issues. Anybody that wants to fight me, you go get problem. Now you go suffer and I go call it what, what, what. Because some of us, we are, we are, we are, we are God saints. Yes, there are some people you don't fight them. The same thing, those that they are fighting Marwa, to them, they may seem to be winning, they may seem to be excelling, they, may be, they might be getting the views, they might be getting the, attach, the attention, but let me tell you, truth will never and it shall never prevail. Lies will never and it shall never prevail over truth. A time shall come, the truth shall rise like a phoenix from nowhere and it shall excel and not only stop that. That is just the basis and that is just the truth today, guys. Yes, why am I saying this thing? Another confirmation, end of Nyabohanze lazy gangs. Yes, guys, if you remember, I've done a video recently. Later to unwise, three unwise Nyabohanze lazy gangs member. And attack them, as I've said, attack them, attack them. It's Ernest, it's uh, Francis Masubo Peter, or popularly known as uh, Masubo 1 or Masubo 0, that I love to call him, and Max Zero. Yes, Max Zero from Kenya, which is Max 1, Max Zero, the, the, a grown up man that, that came out and he was, you know, crying on, on, on YouTube space, crying, weeping like this. In fact, when Coco Girl brought this guy, I got to know about Max, Max Zero. When Coco Girl brought his story, Coco Girl said he met her, he was crying. Coco Girl, you know, posted his story on her community tab. That was when I got to. In fact, I even went to his channel to drop a comment. Not knowing that that guy was a lazy gang, that guy was, he was going to become a thorn in the flesh of Boss Marwa. 
And since then, I said, wow, because he was crying. He said, after finishing school, he's finding life difficult and he's trying to contemplate suicide. And I said, no, let's go some of us. We have this gift of going to, if we will share our energy with people, people have this feeling. If I, if I am lying, ask anybody that I, have, I must have talked about you. you. You you have this energy, this positivity and radiance about you. Because some of us, we are sent by the universe to bring healing to this world. Yes. So, you, Max, Max One, you wept, you cried on television. People were, people were sympathetic to your cause, so you were just shedding co crocodile tears. Today, you see, your end has come. Any house that was not built on the foundation of truth, any house that was never built on truth, any house that was never let suddenly its foundation on truth, it must fall like a castle of sand. Yes, it's just like a sand in the river. You use the sand in the river to build a house. Within a jiffy, everything gonna crumble down like a pack of cards. Yes. Because you cannot fight people that God has chosen. You cannot fight people that God, they have been doing this genuinely, purely, in, you know, intentionally. They've taken it upon themselves to use their platform to support others, to use their platform to make sure they change, they transform the lives of people in their community. Just like boss, I am Marwa. You guys has the court to be coming on television in liaison, in collusion, in collaboration with Lazy Gang, the big Modesta, and the Black Ugly, and the AM Carrot. You'll be talking nonsense on television, lambasting, lampooning, calling Marwa name, calling his family name, you know, trying to like, be a thorn in the flesh of these people. We told you, people like me, when I talk, my things are not coming from me. I don't talk for talk glory. I don't talk, I don't talk for, for glory or clutching or fame, no. That is why like me, you see me, I've been doing this thing, I've been doing this YouTube, and I'm running it even when I get views, I don't get views, it doesn't matter. And I'm okay, but one thing I know, I am saying the truth, and nothing but the truth. And when I talk, I don't just talk for talking's sake. When I talk, I ensure that this talk is really meant to pass out a message. And the message is not from me, the message is from the universe. I receive downloads, and I have to pass it on. You see, I've been telling you guys, you see, the end of Lazy Gang in Yapohanze, Max one, Masubo zero, um, it's earnest. You see guys, I woke up to the news of the fight of these three criminal elements. Sorry to use that word, criminal elements. If it is not criminal elements, you see, you, 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 you can see. So, you guys thought you can just come on camera, say nonsense and go scot-free? Sometimes, some people like us, when you talk nonsense about us, you get served with the breakfast with Otto. You have breakfast with the collector and the chopper immediately. Now, what's going to happen with that? So, make you learn sense tomorrow. You're not going to follow the talk anyhow for people. Yes, you're not going to follow the talk anyhow. We're not to the young apata. We're not to the young These three unwise men, you, Max Zero, Max Masubo Zero, and it's NX. We're not too much. It's the more that Johan, Johan would Mawa try to build your community, try to make your community better because of say Mawa don't they bring better team, but that thing will make sense to your community in your When they are dead, they just they put on camera, they talk nonsense, they insult this guy, they insult him family, when are the mad, something they do when I head, when are the men's, when are the men's, something they do when I head, they do for now, now for now they do, what is the worry you now? You see, I've been telling you, in that video, guys, I told them, I said, see, the best thing, that letter to the three on West, the best thing you guys can do is to see how to, you know, last what I am Marwa. Because Marwa has single-handedly uplift in your Bohanse. So what Marwa's needs is support, support system, vibrant support system. But you guys are busy talking. You want what Marwa is getting. The fame Marwa has gotten. You want to get it overnight. It is not possible. 
Yes, and Masubo Mwan, in your distance, let me tell you, violence beget violence. You are trying to tell us that, in your video, you are trying to tell us that, eh, I'm not a violent person, I'm not a bad person. The Jesus want to make me look like a bad person. They went and did it. You are a bad person. Even though sometimes, in a time makes sense, but like nonsense full your brain. You are mumu not too much. You are mumu not too much. Eh? Violence beget violence. So what do you define? You go collect them. What do you look for? You go collect them. You go receive them. You stay mad. What are the men? Violence beget violence. And I've been saying this thing. Lies have an expiring date. Because you cannot fight God's chosen one. You cannot fight God's anointed one. Marwa is not your mate. It's not your mate. Grace, you are carrying your mate. Marwa know they play local league. Marwa na international league in the play. Marwa na, na champion in the play. As champion, we in B. That is why recently I do a video. They try advice and say, not everybody in will answer them. Because Marwa na big God, greatest of all time. Marwa na big man, we will not know. Because there is no one that the Bible says a prophet is not honored in his own hometown. If not, you guys don't know what you have in the person of Aymawa. You guys don't know. But you find it difficult. You find it difficult to be, to be accountable. You find it difficult to be transparent. You find it difficult to be loyal. You guys, you just think you just come online and talk nonsense, talk this, talk that, talk this. Guys, I am happy. Yes, the end has come for the Nyapohanze Lazy Gang. Another confirmation, guys. I've been telling us all things that I've been talking so far in my videos are coming to they are coming into reality. They are playing into reality. I did the advice that I do give Marwa. And Marwa has been receiving them and taking them and putting them into use. Or are we talking about my this thing, my letter to fellow the boy. Fellow the boy. Oh, are we talking about my people? We've seen it, we've seen them, they're back now. They're back. And check, as they're back now, check my people's views now. The views has skyrocketed, it has gone up again. That is why I said in my first letter to, 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 to my soup, no, no, to fellow the boy, I said, you can never outsmart your master. You can never outsmart. All of you guys can never outsmart Marwa. Agreed. Anybody, a teacher can teach you, and a student can grow and surpass the teacher. But you must accord your teacher the maximum respect and honor because he channeled you, he held you by the hand, he brought you out of darkness and showed you to the world and told you this is the way to go. And that is why in West Africa, with the follow talk and say, follow person where no road. Yes, when we mean by follow person with no road, that means follow the one that knows the way or that has the solution. And it is not that's literal, literary explanation or meaning, but the, in a, at a deeper level, what that thing means is what you should do, you should be able to be loyal. You should be able to be loyal. You need to be loyal always. Can, can you imagine? You guys are now fighting over pity. That was the cause of issue that Nairobi teacher caused between my popo and I am my yugno. But I am happy. My, my popo has listened to my advice. My popo has listened to my advice. And today, my popo has taken it upon himself. He went back and they've settled their rifts and beef. You can see his views is going up. And you can see, I, I, I have been telling them, I can't wait. For them to come back what i just want from them now is to sit down compose a good song give us a hot dance dance or song in my you know featuring my popo because those guys are really talented they're gifted they're unique they're comical they're full of but when you see them you know them when they were starting you know, they, they don't know how to speak English. They'll be speaking, this. you'll be hearing them, or you mean, Shago. They'll be speaking Swahili, Shago. They'll be saying things like, all those things used to make me happy. 
even as much as I don't know the meaning. But I, I can see young people. Guys, because I'm a development practitioner and also a de youth development professional or consultant. I was happy to see young people like myself trying to carve a niche for themselves, trying to make a name for themselves. But all of a sudden, another stupid and useless youth like Nairobi teacher came in between them trying to. So you, you think you will just come and get viewers when you get a, a, a certain amount of viewers, you go against Marwa. You'll be talking nonsense. Don't see they no go back you. Yes. Into end up who? Nyabohanze lazy gang, another confirmation. I have been saying it, guys. I, I, I have been saying it in my video. I have a gift. And this gift is not meant to... I won't use it to manipulate anybody. But I'll use it for the common good of humanity. And the, anywhere there's truth, you'll find me there. Yes. Yes. That's why I have been saying the issue of Marwa receiving hatred solely is traceable to uh, Wademaya and also his sister being a, a woman or a lady that she is. But Wademaya was scared because Wademaya thought he has, he has taken over the, the social media space in Africa. That was what he thinks. He thought, he was thinking, I mean, Wademaya thought he, has, he is now the champion, the, the, the conqueror, the lion. He never knew that Mawa started even force before him. Even when the Maya he interviewed, guys, I'm a long vet. <laughs> if I start to mention some YouTubers, some of you don't even know them. How I'm a long time vet. I've been watching YouTube a long time. Long time. I've, I know I know how many persons that I've viewed. But all of a sudden, you just know Marwa recently, some two to three years ago. You are now putting on camera. You are a reacto. I am not a reacto. I am sending positivity. And I'm sending light. And I'm speaking truth. That is why, whether I get views, I don't get views, I know mm -mm. I'm speaking the truth. I mean, I'm standing for the truth. And today, Belay, they sweet me. Yes. That is just the beginning when I never see anything except when I apologize to Ayam Marwa. Yes, Maziro from Kenya, Masubo Zero from Kenya, it's earnest. You guys must have to apologize to Marwa. If not, this is just the beginning. Even if you like, try and patch up the relationship. It's good, but next, next, if you guys patch up the relationship, to be like, oh, you've settled, like, the next one will consume you guys. And maybe you, you will hear the story or will watch it on the YouTube space that you guys have boxed one another. Yes, because you cannot fight some people. You don't fight some people and go scot free. That is just the truth and nothing but the truth. Yes, you think you can just do what you feel like doing? And in that video, in his video, my super one was telling her, I am a hustler. Uh, I'm a hustler and this and that. If you are, you are not a hustler, if you are a hustler, you will never go against a marwa. Masubuwon, if you are a hustler, you will never go against. You, do, you think we don't know you? You are his cousin's sister, Priska Sagat Segati. She has told us about you. She's your cousin's sister. Oh, is, is she not your cousin's sister? She has told us about you. She has told us who you are. You are not a hustler. I'm a hustler. I use the machine. I do this. I do that uh, to feed my family. If you have family or you have children as you claim, you cannot go against another person's child who is I am Marwa. You cannot talk nonsense about another person's child who is I am Marwa. Just imagine those who are children, they are, they are excelling, they are thriving in life. Somebody will become, somebody will not take on camera and be speaking nonsense about them. How will you feel? How will you feel, Masubo Zero? This is a food for thought for you. I don't talk for talking sense, sake. And I'm not clutch and I'm not looking. That's why I told you guys, I don't give a damn. If fame come, fine. But I'm standing up. And I'm pushing positivity for a Marwa. I am not a reactor. I am not a reactor. And my videos are not reaction. My videos are purely 
downloads and truth and nothing but the truth from the universe to anybody. If you like, listen to it. If you like, don't listen to it. Yes. Yes. This is not the video that I wanted to do today, but I see the urgency in this video. The video I wanted to do today is the continuation of Marwa's letters to the subscribers. And I wanted to talk to talk to David. I address his younger brother, David Gino. A letter to David Gino. Yes, guys, if you've been following me, you know that I've been I said I love David Gino. I know when Marwa opened YouTube channel for him. In fact, Marwa in, in Yabuhan said the first person that was supposed to be the first beneficiary of Marwa's kindness and goodness and benevolence was Sintake. Or Manu, they call him Manu. Because Marwa brought him to us before when Marwa was starting Villa Medijim Foundation Uni. He was the first person. We were waiting on, on Marwa to bring on the guy. We didn't hear from him again. But he now brought on um, David Gino. But you guys have the guts to be talking nonsense and spin nonsense against the person I'm personally. Like. You are not a hustler. Masubo, if you're a hustler, you won't be talking, trash talking somebody's child. So your end has come. No, we are not get sense. We are not get sense. You guys will just be doing nonsense. You guys will say, it's, 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 it's wrong. Highly, highly wrong. Don't you ever in your entire life go against someone that God has blessed. God has given him the opportunity and permission to excel and, you know, impart life. But that teaches you truth. And End up. Confusion in the come up. Confusion in the camp of what? Nyabohan the three unwise men. Guys, if this is your first time of being on my YouTube channel, or this is your first time of stopping by, guys, here, we give you the very best of content, relatable, straight up from Africa, guys. Very soon, we'll be, you know, showcasing the beauty of Africa, straight up from Abuja, Nigeria, any other part of the world or Africa to you guys. Stay put content are coming and also if you are a young professional a young person that wants to go abroad and study then come back because we the study abroad opportunities where we want to the information we want to share is for youth that they want to go abroad study to be impacted with skills knowledge and come back use the transferable skill set to impact and transform their community because we are after Transformation, just like Bos Marwa, just like what Bos Marwa is doing in Yapuanze, just like what Marwa has done in Yapuanze. Yes, we are about that. You go to abroad, study, be impacted with skills, and then you now come back to the village and transform your community. Because the essence of education and change is just one person spearheading it. You don't need two heads. Or two. No, change that with you. And it's because of that change, I am standing up and speaking the truth. And anything in the video I do here is not from my personal sentiment. Or, no, it's not influenced by anybody. That's why you, if you, when you listen to me, you see my, my way is different from any That's why is it because I'm not a reactor, maybe. Strictly, even if we are going to be documenting traveling experiences and uh, and um, and um, study abroad opportunities on this channel, maybe as we grow and evolve, maybe we will be dedicating weekends, Saturday and Sundays, to be talking about content regarding the global text or about Bos Marwa. So we'll be compiling things that happen throughout the weekend. Then we'll be talking about them in but we throw out the weekdays and then we'll be talking about them at the weekends that's just the truth yes that's what we intend to win when we intend to when i will be bringing you all guys content traveling experiences and story abroad opportunities that's what we think so guys confusion in the come of the wicked the wicked has no place no peace for the wicked the wicked must pay the only for their wicked acts. Yes, guys, if this is your first time of being on my YouTube channel, this is priceless. 
I am great and I'm grateful, grateful always. Thank you for always coming back to watch my videos. Thank you for always checking up on my content. Guys, I'm grateful. I don't take your views. I don't take your interaction. I don't take it for granted. I am loyal. I am loyal, guys. Thank you for always coming back to watch my videos. Yes, guys, see us in our next video.